How much were you wanting for your rock band, ma'am? I haven't put any of it down yet. Okay. Rock band? Rock band. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, I'll put these in there too. I'm gonna get those. There's that. Thank you. I'm gonna get these two pieces of artwork too. I can just set them right here if that's okay. What am I up to so far? What's, what do you have? That's One, a dollar and, and a dollar. Thirty-five. Thirty-five, okay. All right, I think I'll settle up with what I got. Okay, yep. I got okay. enough damage for one day. So it's thirty-five and it's... There's forty. Thank, Thank you, you so you much. Good luck with the sale. Thank, Thank you. you. How much is your uh, rock band game? Chrissy, how much is rock band game thingy? Oh gosh, you're trying to get that out. Yeah, I got a lot of stuff over here. Just, no, 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 just push the whole box. How much were you wanting for your rock band, ma'am? I haven't put any of it down yet. Okay. Rock band? Rock band. Um, those are all the uh The camouflage are uh, steel tough. $10 What? Oh, your phone doesn't. She got a brand new Pro Max and it won't work. Oh, wow. It won't work? No, won't work. Pro Max. How about 50? I can do, would you do 40? I can do 40. Yes, ma'am. 45. Okay, I'll do that. And the, how much are the trunks? The green. Do you know what Wood those trunks? Are? No, what are they? Those are antique band trunks. No kidding. I need help. So you can oh, tell. I have a musician in my family. Yeah, those are really cool. Um, yeah, they're antique band trunks. So they used to load them up in the, their instruments. Very neat. I would like 20 a piece for those. 20 a piece for them? Yes. I will buy one of those. Okay. So yeah, 65. You pick You pick out which one you want. Okay. They're there you go. Cool. Okay, so we have 45. Plus another 20, 20 for the thing, okay. yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, how's it going, man? What's up, dude? Did you find some stuff? I never thought I would see you out here. What's yeah. your name? I'm Nick. Nick, nice yeah, to meet you, man. Nice to meet you. Old Olympic hat and some old 80s shirts. Oh, nice, man. Yeah, What's that like one? A bowling, bowling coach balls? or something. Oh, those are sweet. Yeah, I was pretty excited to find those. Nice. 
That's like the only clothing in there. Yeah. That's what I look for mainly. Yeah. Do you go to the sales in Mason yet? I haven't yet. I was on my way. They're pretty decent. Yeah? Yeah. Find you won't find any clothing at the, um, <laughs> not at the one on Elter. I would avoid that one. But okay. the one on Acoma, not a lot of clothing, but there's just a ton of yeah. good stuff there. So, yeah. Great to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Nick. Yeah, good luck to you. Greg, hey. you got a whole box of stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah what'd you get? This kind of matches the old reds one I have. Like it, like oh, that's yeah. awesome. Yeah. That's really cool. You need a box, sir? Uh, probably, you yeah. Buy more stuff? I'm gonna <laughs> probably get this right here. What did you have this price at? I didn't see a price on that. Oh, uh, like two bucks. That's fine, yeah. Would you go um, 15 on the clock? 15 on the, or what yes. is it? Okay, right. mm -hmm. I'll do that and I'll keep shopping too. Not here, oh, that's cool. Gotta get the nutcracker. Alright. Oh, Whoa. Nickel. That is cool. She's yeah. wheeling and dealing. Fishing. Yeah, if you don't want them, I'll make an offer. Yeah, good for it. Okay. Yeah, I just, I think oh, this awesome. gotta be 70s. That is really yeah. neat. That's a good eye, man. I wouldn't have even looked at those. I have a question for you. Yes. Um, these were behind the Elvis record. I didn't know if you'd sell those separately. Three bucks. That's fine. I'll take those. I didn't want to take it out of the collection. Right. I saw you were trying to sell it all together. Like Would you do 15 for the pair of yep. those? Okay. Uh -huh. And then I'm ready to settle up with you. All right. So 18. Yep, and I've got a box of stuff right there behind oh, yeah. you. Uh, when they tore down, my husband and his dad went and took a brick. Yeah, that is really neat. I know. Um, I've also got that white oh, here, and piece right there. Yeah. yeah. No, I, I am that. Was that added in? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck with the sale. Thank you. Hey guys, it is Monday morning, and on Saturday I went to three garage sales, and for only hit three sales, I found a lot of stuff. I got it all pulled out. I'm going to show you what I found. The first sale I went to, I got a lot of stuff. I got two pieces of artwork. This right here is McQueen's Sportings, the silks and satins of the field. Uh, this is just a print, but it's matted. It's in a nice frame. It was only four bucks. So I went ahead and got it. This right here is an original painting, which is really rare to find at a garage sale. It was only four bucks. I didn't notice it at the time, but it had some damage. The canvas has been kind of pushed out a little bit right here. So that'll definitely hurt the value. On the back of it, it says the artist is, that says Blesh or B. Hesh. Subject is lands. It's uh, got a registry number. This right here is some kind of code. I'm guessing they got this from an auction or something. So I'm gonna have to research this a little bit and figure out who the artist is. Also at that sale, I got um, an audio book, new in the plastic for a buck, um, some DVDs. These right here aren't really worth anything. I only paid a dollar each. But these right here, kind of odd, obscure titles, have a little bit of value. Elvira's Haunted Hills, that's going for about $15 free shipping. David Hasselhoff and Jekyll and Hyde. I, was, I saw this and I'm just like, what the heck? Like, you just know it's going to be bad. So I went ahead and bought that. I didn't look any of these up. Uh, this is selling for about 15 free ship. And this one right here, Victor Victoria, new in the plastic. I think it's going for like 12 or $13 free ship. Got this Lego brick calendar for $8. The box is pretty beat up, but it is a uh, brand new seal. It's never been opened. Um, I saw one brand new sell for $80, but mine in the condition it's in, I might get 50 or 60. We'll see. I got this framed bass beer advertisement. I just thought that had a cool look to it. Also picked up a couple of new in the plastic NFL new era brand beanie hats. These are they're called palm knits. 
Minnesota Vikings, Kansas City Chiefs, and they're selling for about $16, $17 free shipping. I was loading some of this stuff in my car, and I had to come back for the artwork. And when I came back, she actually had brought this out. This is a tailor-made ghost putter. I'm sorry, tailor-made white smoke putter. Brand new in the plastic. Paid $6 for it. I can't find any eBay sold comps of a brand new one, but I did see a used one um, going between like 50 to 70 bucks. So I think I might be able to get 100 bucks for this. At another sale, I got this Gordon's Fish. What is this? The Captain Handy Dandy's Funko. This is this is really weird. I guess like you put your hand in it, and it's like a hand puppet. I think they charged me two bucks for this, or maybe 75 cents. I don't know. It wasn't very much money. I couldn't find any active or sold listings on eBay, so it's definitely rare, but it might not be valuable. I don't know. I'll have to do some more research and figure it out. Got this Star Trek Romulan Warbird, probably mispronouncing that. Keepsake ornament for a dollar. That's going for 25 bucks. Ran into my buddy Greg at that sale, and he pointed out these Easter Island head mugs uh, and they are from king's island probably from the late 70s i'm pretty sure that's when king's island opened it's a local amusement park um, i got the pair for 15 haven't been able to find anything on them yet i'm sure they're super rare uh, whether or not that equates to value i'm not sure but i have sold some king's island uh, souvenirs before and done pretty well with them so we'll see got this little cincinnati reds nutcracker for a dollar i'm just gonna keep that picked up this really cool Bengals. NFL like coat rack or wall hanger looks like somebody got it at Goodwill originally and paid eight bucks um, I paid 15 and I think I should be able to get 50 or 60 bucks for it just because it's vintage has a really cool look to it I got this coca-cola Neon clock. It's not vintage, but it is brand new in the packaging. It's from the Bradford exchange It even has a little like metal thing here to put like a menu or something they were asking 20 I got it for 15 bucks. Couldn't find any kind of active or sold listings, but I just think it has a cool look to it. So I think there's a little bit of money to be made there. Last thing I got at that sale are these record frames. There's three of them brand new in the plastic. I bought a handful of these to uh, frame up some of my albums. And when you buy a pack of three at Michael's, I want to say they're like 15 or 20 bucks, something like that. They're not cheap. So I was more than happy to pay three bucks. I'm just going to keep those. At another sale, I got this really cool trunk for $20. I'm just going to keep that. And by far my best find of the day is Rock Band 2 for PS3. It's got the drums, the guitar, has the uh, foot pedal, the drumsticks, the microphone. There's two dongles in there, which usually are missing from these things, and the game. I saw the same one sell recently for $350, but it had an extra guitar. So I'm thinking mine might be in like the $250 to $300 range. We'll see. That is it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.